Howdy friends and welcome back. Here's a look at our current conditions. Amarillo 68 degrees. The winds are a bit breezy from the south at 18 miles per hour. Not too bad, but a nice little uh, breeze going on this morning, which we'll have more of in the afternoon. Really just continuing on the trend of hot temperatures in the 90s and breezy winds. And really that's going to be the case all this week. Humidity down to about 43% this morning, so not very high. And of course we are in the drought across the board. The only areas uh, only in the uh, the least uh, round of the drought will be down around Childress. Abnormally dry conditions here in town. We're into the severe drought, as you can see, stretching across the central and northern Texas panhandle. A few spots in the extreme drought uh, is represented by the shade red back towards the north and eastern part of the Texas panhandle, all the way back towards northwestern corner of our area. That's the reality of the situation. We just haven't had a whole lot of rain, as much rain as we need to here in the high plains during the uh, severe weather season, and that severe weather season has come to a screeching halt. And so we have a red flag warning in effect for our northern counties for this afternoon. Dry conditions humidity down to 12% in these areas and of course will be breezy across the board so avoid any outdoor burning basically the situation is we can't affect our, our situation much except to do what we can as humans to prevent any grass fires from developing and they can spread very quickly here in town temperatures will be reaching the lower 80s around noon we'll top out at 92 degrees in Amarillo our average high is 88 so we'll say four degrees higher than our average and there will be a slim chance for a thunderstorm or two up in say Western Union County so northwest of Clayton for this afternoon the rest of us stay on the dry side yet again today. Lake levels like Meredith coming down to 75.71 feet deep and a green belt actually at 46.7 uh, 46.47 feet deep as of right now coming down just a bit. Ute Lake holding steady at 79.8 E, but it did come up uh, come down quite a bit over the weekend a bit of a drop there. I'll take you over to our seven day forecast and temperatures continue on all week long in the lower to mid 90s. 90 for Tuesday. Wednesday will top out at 93. The difference for the latter three fifths of the weekend will be we'll see high temperatures in the 90s, but the bigger issue will be we'll have a, some more Gulf moisture moving to the high plains with a potential for a few isolated thunderstorms in the afternoons. That does include about a 20% chance rain here in Amarillo and Canyon as well. So here's hoping to get some good rain from those storms. Thursday and Friday, more of the same. Juneteenth will top out at 93. First day of summer, 97, and for the remainder of Father's Day weekend, we'll continue on with those temperatures closing in on 100. You can check out that full forecast always at myhighplains.com.